Hi, in this video I am going to show you top 10 CMD commands which are really useful and those are listed here. So now let's begin. I am going to CMD and the first command is I have to change the color of my uh, text as well as the background of CMD. So before proceeding further we have to know about that which are the basic colors that we can use. So we have color help option. So once we shall click here, uh, you will find out that all those possible colors are listed here. So now, for example, I want to I have chosen black background with white text. So I will write here color, and for the sake of black, I will write zero for background and seven for white. And now you can see the color has been changed. The next command is change directory. For say example, you want to go to desktop directory. So you will type cd and desktop. And you are now inside the desktop. So one more, one more trick, for example, uh, you want to go to a specific uh, uh, folder. For say example, d in d disk, you want to go to any specific folder uh, which you want. So here is the option. For say example, I have this particular folder and uh, I want to go it go to it directly. So here you have the option of uh, writing here CMD. Means once you will click over here and you will find out that you are inside that specific folder. So this is the simple way to go, go to a specific folder without writing CD again and again. So the next uh, thing is clip content and paste. For example, you have needed the content that is over here on the CMD and you want to copy from here and paste to another text file. So here you have the option of IP config. Sorry, config pipe and clip. Sorry, IP config. And once you will click the whole content has been copied now and if you want to paste somewhere then you can go to that specific text file and here you have to paste so now the, the whole content that was on the CMD has been copied and pasted to the other file so this was the third thing now come to the next thing which is hide and show folders as you know that we regularly needed to uh, hide and show the folders but the thing is that for say example we have actually two ways to hide and show the folders for example I have demo folder and I want to hide this I will go to the properties and then I will click on hidden then once click on ok then my folder has been hidden but if somebody will uh, go to the option sorry folder folder option then he will go to the view and once he will click show hidden files and press ok then that specific folder would be shown here you can see here this was the demo folder that i has i have hid i have hided uh, before but right now uh, i uh, go to the uh, folder option then from there I have clicked on check the checkbox of uh, show hidden folders then that hidden folder has been shown now but I want to uh, hide it properly in such a way that no one could able to uh, show it uh, without any uh, name right so that is also simple what you have to do is you have to write here attrib Firstly, you have to go to that specific folder. So, let me open up again. And uh, that folder is on the desktop. So, I will go to desktop. And here I have the folder of, I have to check the folder, which is uh, once I will write dir command, then the folder list would be displayed. So, I have to uh, I have to hide this test folder right so test folder I want to hide so I will write 
ए डबल टी आर आई बी एट ट्रिप प्लस एच प्लस एस प्लस आर एंड देन नेम ऑफ दैट स्पेसिफिक फोल्डर टेस्ट वंस आई विल क्लिक देन द टेस्ट फोल्डर हैज बीन हिर एन नाउ so now if you want to show that specific folder you can also again write the same command but instead of writing plus you will write minus and again once you will click here you will find out that your folder has been displayed here which is test so this is one of the best way uh, using which you can hide your folders through the command prompt next trick is next is change title for say example you want to change the title of uh, your for say example you want to change the title of your uh, cmd you can write here title ramzan so now you can find out that here the title is ramzan and this was the fourth point fifth point sorry then after i have to change prompt name for say example you want to uh, you are going to use uh, this specific uh, path c user stumble on desktop over and over again and if you don't uh, wa uh, want here this specific path again and again and you want to uh, use according to your choice then you can write prompt for say example i want to write here my name only and dollar g sorry not from here you have to oh sorry this has been solid dollar i am going to reopen it once again prompt ramzan dollar and capital g so now you can find a, see that ramzan and greater than so now you can use this specific uh, name through audio command prompt until you are not changing it so uh, from where i have uh, got the g so here is help prompt sorry help prompt so you would have uh, all these possible uh, choices that whichever symbol you want to use uh into your name so in this way you can uh, explore these all these things are displayed here right so this was the next trick that i have shown you and the next thing is check ip address for say example i want to know about my ip address that what is my ip address right now so i will use ip config and now my ip address is ipv4 192.168.137.136 so this is my ip address right now right so you have used ip config command next is internet working or not for say example you want to know about that uh, my internet is working or not or connected or not so you have a simple command uh, ping ping right so only writing ping is will not work you will write you have to write ping and then for say example www.google.com so once you will write that you will find out that here you will have loss equal to 0% if you you are getting loss equal to 0% and ttl equal to some values then it means that your packets are not going to loss you have sent four packet and you have received four packet it means the internet is working fine so this is the way to check the ip address uh, to check to check the uh, internet uh, that your internet is working or not next is there are simple things dir cd arrow key so for say example you want to uh, see uh, the arrow uh, you want to use the previous commands that were used by you you will use arrow key up and down 
up and down to uh, find out whichever commands you have used are until now and you have another option of f7 from f7 if you will click uh, if you will click f7 then you will find out all those possible commands which you have used in this session next is cd cd means change directory for example you want to uh, you want to come out from this specific folder then you will write cd dot dot and if you want to enter into this specific folder then you will uh, write cd and name of that folder and one more thing is tab for say example i want to go to desktop i have no need to write the full name of the desktop i have to write de and then in press tab then the desktop would name would automatically come and then enter so i think all the things i have uh, mentioned and one more thing was uh, dir dir means all those folders and files inside the desktop folder would be shown here so this is the list of all those folders that are inside the desktop folder so in this way you can explore all these commands uh, into your pc and i think these are really great uh, and important commands that you have learned today you have to practice in your pc or maybe laptop so that you could find out uh, that yes these are fruitful and we can use it in daily life so that's it in the next video we would be learning about another cool concept so before ending this video i request you to support my channel by subscribing it if not subscribed yet just subscribe it on clicking at subscribe button right bottom of your screen like this video share this video to your friends for any query please feel free to ask below in the comment i appreciate your feedback if you have any have a nice day ahead